Have you ever wondered what would happen if we used a Final Smash on our friend Mr. Sandbag? Normally we can't use a Final Smash in the Home Run Contest, but with a little bit of modding, we can see whose Final Smash can send the Sandbag flying. Also, each character is allowed to use one neutral attack before unleashing the Final Smash so Mr. Sandbag doesn't stick to the ground. Every character who don't pass this challenge will be deleted from Smash Bros. Ultimate. Anyways, smash the like button if you enjoyed this video. By the way, this video is sponsored by Guardian Tales, which is an adventure RPG for the Nintendo Switch. This game contains a lot of references to games, movies, anime, TV, and pop culture. There's a lot of support characters and tons of weapons such as swords, bows, hammers, and massive weapons like rocket launchers. All weapons and characters have their own set of skills for different strategies and fun. The visuals on this game have some beautiful scenery. The pixel art style is incredible and has been crafted down to the smallest detail, bringing each world and character to life. As a Zelda fan, I can see quite a few references to Link to the Past. This game also has various themes such as Christmas, snowy mountains, desert, forest, and so much more. Also, there's an update coming on July 4th for World 13th Low Earth Tower. As you meet with the Demon Queen, a sudden terror strikes and the tower has been hijacked by relentless terrorists. Be sure to unravel the mystery behind the menacing Doblegator, a false knight who mirrors your appearance and unlock the hidden powers of the princess. You will need to decipher who's behind the chaos and unlock the truth by playing Guardian Tales for the Nintendo Switch. And the best part is, this game is free to play. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
all the characters that pass this challenge. If you're wondering why some characters couldn't pass, even though it looks like some of them should have, well since they normally don't use their final smash in the home run contest, their final smash kind of glitches up. So if I use the final smash, the barrier just won't disappear. But if I wait for the barrier to disappear, then the time limit occurs. 